So we're far more prepared for this season than we were for last year. However, every team's made improvements. Every team's going to be thinking that they've made a big stride forward. So I really don't know what to expect going into the season. It was all new to everyone because it was a Generation 2 car for the first time. So no one really knew where, where they were. Throughout the season, I think we, we made some big steps and we did a really good job. And maybe with a bit more luck, we were fighting for the title till the end. Yeah, I think there's, there's more to, to lose than to gain. More teams, more good teams. So Porsche and Mercedes obviously coming in into it. Um, it'll be exciting, you know, 24 cars on the grid. Sometimes that's going to feel really, really crowded out there. But uh, hopefully, if you're running at the front, it doesn't feel too crowded. I need to win races this year. I hope it's more than one. I hope it's two, three, four. I want to have my name on that trophy at the end of the season that has sort of evaded me so far. Formerly in general has been very competitive. Uh, a lot of drivers and teams can, can win races. It's really a game to, to stay out of trouble and to keep on scoring points even on, on bad days. It will be more interesting, it will be more demanding on, on, on the team itself. It's more like if you see a gap you should go for it. I'd say this is the most stable the team has ever been. Everything is pointing in the right direction for us to have the best chance of having a good season this year. In this championship, there's no bad outfit out there. That's why it's so difficult. That's why this championship is so hard, so competitive and so rewarding when you get it right. There is no weakness in this championship. You've got to be on the top of your game.